Hello. Welcome to a special edition of Getting Ready right With Me. Um, so I got my hair cut last week. If you watched any of those last couple videos, uh, we did like sort of curtainy bang, bang. We didn't do anything real drastic. We tried to keep my length because I have been trying to grow it out from my latest pixie. So there's that. Um, and we also didn't want to do anything like super drastic because I am getting a new job soon. And I don't know what my hours are going to look like, whether I will be remote, ouch, or in office. So we didn't want to give me a really high maintenance cut because I really want a French bob. Um, not knowing what my time frames were going to look like for getting ready in the morning. I have two toddlers, so most of my time spent getting them ready. So we are styling our hair for the first time on our own. Rachel, if you see this, I immediately apologize for everything that's about to happen because I honestly don't know what's going to Okay, so what I want to do is flip it back. So I think I need to go like this. And I am using a curling iron today instead of a flat iron. I can't see what I'm doing because I'm trying to look at the camera instead of the mirror. That is not going to work. Nope, that was wrong. That was wrong on so many levels. I'm going to go this way. How do I make it? Yeah, like this. Nope, that's going to make it go forward. Well, we may be switching over to a flat iron here in a moment. Because that did not do what I wanted it to do. How do I make it go backwards? Y'all, I can't remember how to use a curling iron. I haven't used one in so long. I know there's a way to make it do what I want. I us just do it this way, I guess. Ah, oh, it's smoking, I think. It might be way too hot. Let's turn it down a few notches. All right. Well, there's a start. Okay. I think I just figured it out. <laughs> Durr. Do it the exact same way you would do it with your flat iron. Ding dong. So we will have two videos today. The first one will be this absolute horror show that is me trying to fix my hair. The next one will be me, oh God, I cannot do this. I can't do this. Uh, will be me trying to put on makeup, which I am not hopeful is gonna turn out very good at this point. Okay, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. We're gonna get rid of this guy. Where's my flat iron? Obviously I am not equipped to handle curly iron at this stage of my life. Put it on the floor. Take this bad boy in. Struggle with the mess of my bed behind me. Come on. Go in the hole. That's what she said. There it is. Okay, let's turn this guy on. Now, when I did get my hair cut on Friday, I did not like when we curled it, but we'd also done a really good professional blowout, and it looked great that way, and this is day two, it was not blown out when things were good. So, yeah. Um, well, while we're waiting for that to heat up, we can get a start on the makeup, at least picking it out. So, I may be wearing this spark, oh, snap my own bra, this sparkly silver top. I'm going to have a black jacket over it because um, I think I said I have a job interview today. I don't remember, but I have a job interview today. So, it is virtual. It's not like going to look good from here up. But I want to, yeah, I'm very nervous and I am trying to not be. So for the purple and black, or purple, the silver and black, I think I'm going to go with purple eyeshadow today. Um, I want to be me, but I don't want to scare people, if that makes sense. So I think purple is the way to go. I think I'll also use this Rebel Gray. So this is the Violets by Juvia's, the Rebel Grays by Juvia's. And I think that is what we're going to use today. And we're just going to hope for the best. Now, we are only going to do, like, the visible part of our hair. I am not going to mess with the back. In fact, I think I'm going to clip up everything I don't intend to curl with this giant clippy. Because why well, do more work than I need to? So that just leaves me a little bit to mess with. All right. So we will use these two eyeshadows. We've got our Panorama Mascara our Maybelline Fit Me foundation, our Maybelline 
no, L'Oreal Brow Stylist Definer Eyebrow Pencil. My powder is in the other room. Do I go get it now? Do I go get it later? I'm gonna go get it now. I'll be right back. You enjoy this beautiful scenery that is my bedroom. Powder. Lipstick that we're not going to wear. We're going to put this away. What is this? That's a red. So you go over here. I've got like the red side of my lipstick divider and then the everything else side. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, we'll pick a blush later. Okay. I think we are warm enough to do some curling. I really should have put a heat protectant in, but I was not thinking about fixing my hair when I washed it and failed to dry it two days ago. So we're just gonna, hope we don't do too much damage. I am using, nope, not hot enough yet. Uh, this flat iron by DNA Hair Tools. I got this at IMATS Atlanta the first time, like six years ago. And then I dropped that one and broke it the first year I had it. So when I went back to the less good IMATS the next year, why am I talking so loud? Uh, I replaced it. I actually, this was the number one reason I went because I was unsuccessful curling my hair with other flat irons at that point. And I really wanted to do it and they did a good job with it. So, oh boy, guys. This is my nightmare. <laughs> That's okay. Everything's going to be fine, right? Probably not a good sign that my pressure cooker that I tried to make oatmeal in this morning did not work properly. <laughs> Cooked the oatmeal, didn't explode, but also spewed steam and grossness everywhere. <sighs> All right, let's try again. We're pretty warm now. I should probably do a better job of like separating out sections and things like that but I don't I don't do that I wing it and I do the best I can mostly because the camera hides a lot of flaws and I see way more people on camera than I do in person so I try to not stress myself out about it too much that was no bueno let's get a better grip on that so I'm just clamping it and then squeezing it and pulling it down as I rotate. Okay, we're going to come back here and do this front patch again. And I usually try to hold it pretty close to my head so that it gets those shorter hairs. And there I find a lot of times those just get missed because curling iron is too far down. And then this little corner chunk here, we're just gonna wrap, 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 wrap. I hope something good happens with it. And nothing good happened with it, so we're gonna try again. Leave that side alone for a minute and come over here. Start with this front section, curling away from my face. Get wrapping it and pulling it down. Okay. <laughs> you did not get curled. Get out of the way. All right. Because I have this teeny tiny hair clip right here, I'm just gonna. That out of the way and keep on going. Alright. Still curling down and it woo, did not work the way I wanted it to. Get away 
from my face, pulling it down, 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 down. This is just the view in this camera lens on my phone is different than the view in the mirror, so it's just a little bit awkwarder. More awkward than it normally is. Let me tell you, it's usually pretty awkward. What is with these hairs that are not getting in there? You get up here. Okay. Getting something going here. Something's happening. I think that something is that this side's gonna look a lot better than the other side. <laughs> think that's in the hot part of the iron. I don't know if you just heard my elbow pop or not, but that was super fun and felt amazing. So let's try. Woo! And curl it. Here we go. Get it over there. Ouch. Okay. Try to remember where my little clippy is. It does. Okay, I'm going to take this down from the back so that it's this side just does not look finished at all let's go over it again here I need a low maintenance hairstyle but I want like the structured hair that like needs to be fixed it's a hard kind of thing to reconcile because I am not good at hair and granted I do not practice nearly enough to try to get really good at doing my hair but that's another story for another day sorry for that very brief flash of face please don't screenshot that I think this is what we are gonna get. It's not too bad. We got a little bangage. All right. I have a Garnier Flexible Control Hairspray. This is just the one I have. I was needing a really light hold hairspray. I was at a CVS. They did not have a lot of selection. And this was the lightest hold they had, and that is what I needed was really light hold. So, just blasting some of that in there. Only need it for a couple hours today, anyway. So, okay. So, there is phase one getting the hair done. I'm gonna close this out, and I will start a new video where we get into the makeup. So I hope you learned absolutely nothing from this because if you learned anything, you did not learn the right thing. Um, but hey, random ramblings of someone you don't know. Why not? So if you watched, thanks and I'm sorry. And hopefully the makeup video turns out a little bit better. Okay. All right. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>